The conservative outrage machine is still coming to grips right now with the fact that North Face has a yearly Pride video, but some have now realized that weeks ago, Harley Davidson and Budweiser started having collab content come out with a beer can, as you see behind me, and they're starting to freak out against Harley Davidson because this conservative sphere that's upset, they're just a bunch of bigots and they have to find anything to rage about but I find bikes very boring. So I'm just gonna do the work for you. This isn't new. The company's always been LGBTQ friendly. Watch this video, get it out of your system and go boycott something else because I find bikes boring and I just don't wanna cover them. Let's begin. Harley Davidson has celebrated pride plenty of times before and you can look it up. Go to their Instagram. They celebrate pride. The Wisconsin LGBT Chamber is proud to be accepting applications for the inaugural cohort of the LGBTQ plus entrepreneur boot camp powered by Harley Davidson. Yes, this is a thing actively going on right now. And if you go to the list of sponsors, here's some even more you can complain about because you're a bigot. Look, I'm giving you a list how easy this is. It's basically every company in existence. Now, of course, there's more. Here are some of the top business partners for LGBTQ inclusion in Pennsylvania. And look who you see, Harley Davidson. This was never a secret. You just have to take the name of any company you want and search pride, LGBTQ, and you will find exactly the same type of content. And look, to help you get it out of the system, I know the conservatives can't meme. Go ahead and just copy all your memes from South Park when it comes to Harley Davidson. They're right there. Just get it out of your system so you can start boycotting something like tampons or bras again where I can make fun of you because I don't want to make fun of you with bikes because I find them boring. Just rage about something else for a little bit. Just something a little more entertaining at least. 